Hi, welcome to Partner Playbook. I'm Tanya Gentry, and I'm here with Michelle Ragusa McBain from Sonicwell. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Tanya. So great to be here. Yeah, thank you for doing this. Um, for anyone that's listening or watching that doesn't know Sonicwell very well, could you give us a brief description? Absolutely. So Sonicwall is a 33-year-old cybersecurity company, most beloved and known for our firewalls. But recently, we've made a lot of changes. We have a brand new leadership team from our CEO, Bob Van Kirk, down, a new CMO, a new EVP of product, a new CRO, and me, so yeah, a new you. channel chief. Yeah, yeah. Um, we've also increased our leadership around the world to make it easier to do business with Sonicwall, with people who really know this industry. Uh, we also have completely relaunched our new tech roadmap. So looking at how we're going to evolve, we know it's not if but when cyber criminals are lurking. Yes. So we want to make sure our customers are prepared and safe at every layer of security. So most recently, we made two acquisitions for solutions granted for MDR, XDR, EDR as well as Banyan Security, so that we have Zero Trust and SASE as well. So we're really excited. We're going to be making a lot of new announcements, a lot of integrations that we're working on, as well as our brand new partner program that we launched in February. Awesome, well, great segue. So tell me, what are some of the key benefits and features of your partner program? Yeah, so it was very important to us that everything we did in this program was built by our partners at, with having them at a seat at our table. So when we asked our partners and our partner advisory council, our technical advisory council, what do you need to be successful? What do you mm -hmm. need to make it easier to do business with Sonicwall? They gave us a lot of feedback. And we took that good, the bad, and the ugly, and we put it together, and we launched our new program based upon their feedback. So whether you're buying an access point, a switch, or a firewall, or you are a managed service provider that has recurring revenue, you'll earn money in our program together. Uh, we lowered the rebate threshold so more partners can earn Great. rebates and put them back into their business to be successful. And we accrued market development funds. And MDF is really there to help our partners co-brand, co-market, co-sell, yep. and yes. co-innovate with us by their side. We want them to be perceived as an extension of our family. That's how we look at our partners. And if we can help them be successful, that's the way we want to do it. And also, we heard that they want flexible consumption. They want billing in arrears. Right. They don't want to make it hard to do business with a vendor. They have a lot of people in their stack. So that is how our program is right now. And if you're not a Sonic Well partner, we'll welcome you in at tier match plus one. So if you work with a competitor today, you're gold at so-and-so, you'll be platinum with us. And oh, we wanna make really sure great. that you don't start at the bottom because we want you to be successful. Great, any enhancements that you wanna talk about that you guys are doing with your partner program for 2024? Yeah, so I mean, outside of the things I've already mentioned, it's really important that we look at the idea of how we're gonna keep you safe and looking at the threat vector. So we have a, secure, a security report. We have sensors in over 215 countries and territories, but now we pair that with Banyans as well as Solutions Granted. Yes. So we do have a pulse of the threat landscape. And as we're looking at that, we, we know it's not um, the firewall. And we know that our partners are the trusted advisors to their clients. And in a post-pandemic world, every customer is now a tech company, mm -hmm. whether whatever vertical, whatever industry right. you're in. Right. And so with that knowledge, we know that they need multiple layers of security. And so um, we are also now ecosystem agnostic. So if you're not a SonicWall partner, but you need to manage your SOC, we have an in-US SOC that is, uh, will monitor your SOC 24 by 7, 365 days a year, provide you a report ever, two times a month uh, about anything that's happening. And if a threat happens, we stop it, mitigate it, and call you every 15 minutes to so pick up. So wow. you don't have to worry about yeah. that in-house. We're going to allow you. And the best part about that is it's ecosystem agnostic. So you can work with Defender, Silence, Microsoft. Uh, we can also work with um, Sentinel One, who's a partner of ours with Capture Clients. So you have multiple options, and even some of our competitors. We just want to keep you safe. That's great. Tell me if I'm a new partner that's coming to you. What what would they need, or what what would you say they should do to be successful with using SonicWall? So I think the most important thing of any relationship, one, is to start with trust, mm -hmm. right? You have to know that your team has your back and we want you to be successful. And that's part of when I say you're an extension of our family. So how do we do that? Well, we've completely changed also our coverage model. Mm -hmm. So now every partner is going to have 
a field territory account manager, inside account managers, engineers, uh, channel account manager. So multiple roles to help you, whether you need to have a demo with your customer or you want to do a co-branded event and have us come speak at it, or if you just need material or, or funds to help be successful. So we're going to make sure that um, our partners are covered and we'd ask for the same reciprocity, right? Mm -hmm. So as you're doing business, how do you bring us in? How do we help you? Um, how do you leverage the MDF that vendors give you? So many partners don't use funds and right. how yes. can we work together to yeah. come up with creative marketing ideas or events with the Chamber of Commerce or sales so that you, you can drive your revenue and we can help you do that. So I think the most important factors of a partner is one, that we're just open and honest with each other. Mm -hmm. Two, that you have a commitment to be successful with us and that's going to help you raise through our program to the next level. And the more you raise, the more you get back, right? More rebates, yeah. more marketing right. funds yes. and so and more discounts. So I think that, you know, it's a two-way street. We're going to invest in our partners. We've increased all these things. We'd love for them to invest back in us. And we also do new customer deal reg. So any partner that brings us a new customer, we give them 50% off that deal because we know that they're competing as well and we want to help drive their success. Wow, that's very impressive. That's great. So last question, coming down the pike, roadmap for 2024. What's what's coming down from SonicWall that, that you want our, our community to know? Oh, so many things. So recently we went to a partner advisory council meeting in Florida. And in that meeting, to show the commitment, we had our CEO, our CMO, our CRO, our EV of product, our two leaders that we just acquired from Solutions Grant to Embanion, as well as our uh, VP of North America and Director of North America and myself, and our Chief Customer Success Officer. And my only rule was, you can present, but you have to listen. We're mm -hmm. not doing this in a vacuum. Yeah. We need our partner's feedback, and if we're not listening to them, then we're gonna deploy something that they don't want or need. Right. So we went right. through our entire roadmap, it took 8 to 5 p.m. So I don't think I could answer it in one question, <laughs> but I would say um, the most important things are, you know, we're doing a lot, even if you're not working with SonicWall, to make sure that you're protected. So we have a new chief security officer and we have an entire team that would listen and answer any questions and provide, uh, provide consultation and feedback based upon whatever you need. But in addition to that, I want our partners to know that as we launch this program, we're doing it with them in mind. As we launch our, our product portfolio, we're doing it not only for them, but for their customers as well to keep them safe and protected. And so a lot of the things that we're doing are really exciting. I like to say we're reimagining SonicWall. Um, I, I kind of equated to the Stanley Cup. How did a 100 year old cup become so hot and viral? Right. Yeah. Because they listened to their customers and they changed how they did business and they adapted and evolved. That's what SonicWall is doing and that's what we want to do to help them also be you know, profitable, easier for us to do business together and drive mutual success. That's awesome. Thank you, Michelle. Thank, Thank you guys you. for listening and we'll talk soon. Thank you.